Ah, uh, yeah, we out here. Uh, represent. Yeah. Uh, that's for later. Huh? Represent Wilberts. Wilberts? Hey, your name is Willie Burtz. Alright, guys. So, welcome to the Sigurilla TV. After uh, a long, long time of not actually doing anything, I'm back. I mean, I think it's been about a month or two since I actually posted some. I think the first time I posted some was like when I first got back to New York. But we're back. Actually, I actually had to wait because I had a bunch of plans set up, which they're all falling together. Um, but we're working on the Honda today. I think I have a bad ignition coil going out. Um, but again, this car's a piece of shit. So, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. Um, yeah, no, uh, I got a bunch of stuff. Uh, well, not a bunch of stuff. But I just got to put new ignition coil into the distributor and uh, see if it runs a little bit better. I think it's just weak. Everything on this car is pretty much like OEM, so like, I mean like not OEM, but obviously it's OEM, but that's, I don't think anything's gonna change, you know what I mean? Like, like you buy a car and you just never know what someone's doing, like, you know what I mean? Like, like you don't know, yeah, it's JDM is fucked, so you never know what people are doing. Um, this is just an ignition coil from Advance, we're just gonna play, see, I don't know when the last time someone change this out so we're just going to change it out anyways um so first things first is what what's the first thing you got to do no you're a fucking liar <laughs> connect the battery and then we may have to disconnect the boost the the charge pipe but anyways we're going to go ahead and do that and we're just going to fast forward into where we get done all right yeah so uh what do we do uh yeah so disconnect the battery and we just got the distributor cover right off and then we're just going to take off phillips and pull the ignition coil so how how fast was that that was like that was like super fast dude i think i don't know it's not really yes. <laughs> but uh yeah two Phillips heads that took like two seconds to take off so uh yeah let's go take that off grab a new one slap it on i'll see you guys in like two seconds yeah like uh two Damn. seconds later check this out bada bing bada boom from 1996 mate this little sucker on here so what they design if this ever focuses is a ignition coil now this right here sends spark into the uh, distributor cap and then distribute it into each wire which hits each of the spark plugs now what i'm doing here is we're just going to go ahead and replace this one because this one looks like a pile of manure out with the old in with the new, with the new. yeah it's the wrong one it's the wrong one so it's the wrong one. Well, uh, next time on the Cigarilla, we're going to get the right one. So, next time on the Cigarilla, we're going to get the right part, which is this one. And not get the wrong part, which is this one. As you guys can see, these are completely different. Yeah, guys. My God, Mom. Uh, so, uh, I guess uh, what we're going to do is show you how to put this back into there. So what you're going to do is grab this. We're going to stick it in there, some way, somehow, it, for one, I had it the wrong way. We're going to stick that in there, we're going to take our two Phillips screws, you guys probably can't even see it because I'm in the way. Um, no, you're not a cameraman, it's right there, it's right there. Well, how are you almost dead already? That's how you install it. You see how quick that was? It was just the... Wait, 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 wait. Ah. That there. That there. Oh, look at this fucking idiot. Jeez. I'm, I'm trying to demonstrate something. You're over here being a douchebag. Well, like, then you gotta put this back on. Like, you're gonna show how to put something back on. Do it the full way. Oh, man. Ah, uh, so, uh, for the past, like, hour and a half, what have we been doing? Yes, this right here. What is this, guys? What is this? Post your comments down below. Let me know what that is to win a free T-shirt from the Sick Gorilla TV. Yes, you already know. Oh, man. Oh, man. This guy's just throwing stuff in here. I guess 
I guess we'll show you this right here. Yes, this is a piston. It it has a huge hole in it. It looks like somebody may have either ran it lean or they ran out of oil more if the sink of focus. Look at that. Oh my god. Anyway, so yeah, so the the block it's definitely shot. Um well it's not shot shot, but it definitely could be bored out. There's nothing too dramatic about uh about the uh the motor being messed up. It's not nothing too bad. The the cylinder walls are definitely scored for a mother like effort like pretty bad but the head is good head looks pretty good we're still going to put we're still going to clean it up we're still going to send it to the machine shop the crank definitely needs to be uh so it looked like it spun a rod well it didn't spin a rod well it, it spun a rod um it definitely somebody ran out of oil so it looks like uh, we're gonna have to send that to the machine shop um what else are we sending to the machine shop Looks like just that and that, no, because that has bearings in it. So just we're going to send the head, the crank, and the block over to the machine shop. Get that done. Uh, what else do we got to do? We have, we just got to get bearings. We're going to get it uh, just from, I don't know what we're going to do yet with this, but we're going to do something awesome, something creative. <laughs> Anywho, uh, so it looks like we got a mess over here. We definitely got to clean that up. I got a bunch of stuff that I got to do on the Civic. That's not my Civic. That's his Civic. Uh, my Civic is right there. Yep, yep. This guy just wants to be like me, which I, I understand. You know, everyone I wants to be like me. Motor. Everyone wants to be. No, I'm, I'm saying the car, the actual car, the Honda Civic. And the, you yeah, know. It was my, it was my first car. I'm not going to say my first car. Anywho, <laughs> so what we're gonna do is uh, we're gonna send off the block, the we're gonna send the block, the crank, and the head off to the machine shop, um, and then we got. I'm gonna I'm gonna go ahead and look out some stuff at Ktune, check out some eBay stuff, Amazon stuff. You guys already know this is just a budget build. Like at the end of the day, this is a garage built motor. Um, again, if you guys. If you guys have an idea of what this motor is, just put your comments down in the comments below. Let me know what you think of it. I would say, I would say, I don't know how I'm going to do it, but somebody's going to get a sweater. Because it's definitely cold outside. Yeah, obviously we're upstate New York. So, um, yeah. So, actually, let's, let's, here, you want to flip the motor over for me? Let's actually go ahead and check out what the motor looks like. Mm -hmm. You have a lift, bro? Wow, this guy's really, really strong. All right, all right. So, definitely dirty. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Oh, God. All right. Uh, one of these in here, I don't have a light. So, this cylinder's good. This cylinder's pretty decent. Oh, yeah, there you go. You got the light. All right. So, number one, this cylinder is pretty good. This one's pretty awesome. This one's good, and this one's just totally fucked. Um, yeah. Man, let me get some light. So y'all see that down there? Like, it's it's bad. Like, but it's like still smooth as fuck. And it could be saved. Like, it looked like it could be saved. So we're gonna go ahead and take it to the machine shop, see what they say about it. Um, if anything, we're probably going to just throw sleeves in it, um, but, I don't know, I don't know, guys, um, well, well, I mean, like, if I told you how much we paid for these motors, like, at the end of the day, it doesn't even matter if it's, like, oh, if it's a loss, because it's just, it's, it's nothing, so, um, we're going to go and see if this could be, we re board out and um, we'll get a board size some obviously bigger um, we'll throw some bigger pistons in here it's definitely it's definitely beefy definitely beefy uh, wall in here so we could do something we do definitely do something so all the parts there extra turbo for this build uh, intercooler bunch of tools whatever so we're just gonna call that a wrap Thanks everybody for watching the Sick Gorilla TV. Yo, we got so much more stuff. So much more stuff we got to do. There's a lot to go for this winter. We're going to do a winter build. We're gonna, throughout the winter, we're going to just pretty much 
just go over this build. We're just going to save up, buy a bunch of dumb stuff, put it together, see what happens. And then, uh, yeah, hopefully she runs by springtime. Um, hopefully before springtime. I'm thinking like January, February. And like we're going to so, test it in your car. So that way yeah. we know test that it. Said test it in my <laughs> car. Um, so that's what we're going to do. We're going to go ahead and check that out and do that. Um, what else are we going to do? What else? So, I mean, we're just going to call that a wrap. So thanks for watching Sick Gorilla TV. This right here is going to be one of our winter builds. And uh, we'll see you guys next time.